Hi, I'm Wade Pryor with Pryor's Nursery, home of the Living Fence. Today we're going to talk about watering your trees. We know that, of course, you have to have water in your soil. So think of these golf balls, the white as soil and the orange as water. So we know we need enough water for the plants to live. But we also need air. We forget about air. So if we think about these yellow balls as air, we also need air in the soil. The pore space in the soil cannot be completely filled by water. We need air or we have a lack of air situation which causes root rot. The anaerobic situation is what makes soils gray and have that sour smell uh, and um, the rot occur. So you always have to have some air in there. So that's why we suggest sometimes planting plants a little high level or a little high, but never deep. The air has to be in the soil or the plant will eventually root rot, especially in February and March in the Northeast when it's cool and the soil is damp and it's raining regularly or we're getting some snows. So how do we tell quickly if our soil is the correct moisture content? Well, if we grab a little bit of soil and we squeeze it in a ball and it falls apart, that's too dry. If we grab some soil and we squeeze it in a ball and it stays in a ball, that's probably about right. And if we grab soil and squeeze it and it oozes out of our hands, well, even though we can make a tight ball, that's just too wet when it's oozing out of your hands. So always remember we need air in the soil as well. In the pore space, the little pores that are in the soil, we need air and water as well as soil itself. Thank you.